Very often people question and debate the purpose of prayer, and they do so understandably. But when they do, I often find myself thinking of individual stories, an individual like Luke, for example. Luke is an artist and filmmaker whose drug addiction took a grip of his life in his late 20s. Luke's ambitions and relationships fell apart and the darkest period of his life took hold. He realized he had a serious problem and tried everything within his capacity at the time to get well. Nothing worked. Unknown to him, throughout this period, his mum had been praying this very simple prayer. Please, Lord, welcome Luke and let him know you're with him. This addiction is beyond our influence. I pray you can send the right people to help and I pray you can give Luke a second chance to do the work I truly believe you intended for him. Well, one day, a chance meeting with a stranger led him to church, except it obviously wasn't chance. On that day, Luke encountered Jesus Christ. A network of prayer and recovery groups quickly opened up to him. Now, after over seven years of continuous sobriety, Luke is free from the terror and pain of addiction. He participates in running the recovery groups that helped him and takes the experience and hope into prisons. He's traveled the world making films, many of which are about the life-transforming love of Jesus Christ, including this one. The prayers spoken by Luke's mum and his subsequent freedom from addiction echo many thousands of life-transforming testimonies around the world. Whatever our struggles, through the confusion and the mess of the world, when life just doesn't make sense, or when it makes huge sense, so both in our darkest and in our happiest moments, Christ is with us, always. Through prayer, Jesus invites us to come alongside him, to take part. God doesn't only meet one in the depths. Christ is available to each of us. He's there for us, wherever we are, whatever our story is. That's why I invite you to join the many thousands of people that have already pledged to pray during Ascension and Pentecost so that more people would come to know a life-transforming relationship with Jesus Christ.